what you lost it all in here, you can put it back in there. So, here's back to zero. We're going to go to add or change a formula. Okay, so we're going to say enter. Enter and check mean the same thing. Alright, so now it's going to ask which formula we want to look at. We're going to go look at formula 8. Enter. So now in formula 8, and these are the things that are at the top. So on your piece of paper, I want you to write down T, M, M, Q, F, 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 H, C, L, S, C, W, S, S, star. All right. So when you get that down, because what we're going to do is each step is going to ask these questions. So we're going to, like step one is this one here. It says number one. So number one, type of rotation. All right, so I'm going to click over here and it'll go to that two. It's right under type of rotation. So while you're in there, if you leave it alone, the machine will tell you what it's doing. So it'll say, do you want to watch two-way wash? If I go up, it'll be a soap wash. If I go zero, I can end the formula. If I go one way wash, it's just going to turn one way. So the one I want is a two way wash. So under the T, I would want a two. So then the next one is minute, minute, second. So it's going to go for two minutes, bath time. See how it went to it? If I just left it alone, it'll show it. And then I can put the numbers in. The next one, that's okay with me, is this temperature. You've got steam back there. So FF is Fahrenheit, so it'll tell it what temperature. If I wanted it to be 150, I could do it. All right, there's hot water and cold water. You got the one, you can press two, but that's all you get is one, one, or, one and zero is all I got. All right, so there's hot water, there's cold water. That's level two. Level two on these machines, they have up to six levels and you can program them in, like if level one is six inches, level is two, it'd be high water, maybe like 12 inches. So those are my levels, so that's the L2. Then you got S, I'm not sure what that is, signal I think. There's this chemical, so if I pick chemical one, it's gonna go off. This is speed, speed one, that's how fast it's turning. Drain is wash. I mean, drain is D for drain at the end. How do I want to drain? I can do a standard drain, I can do a two-way drain, I can do a do not drain, I can do a stop the fill drain. I can do stop the drain, stop fill, I get a bunch of choices. I like the standard drain, so it's zero. All right, so now I'm on step two. So we went through step one. Where was the drain? It's right at the end, you gotta go past you gotta go past it and it comes back up. Yeah, past the star. Okay, so let's make like you number two. And number two, you're gonna have a two for two minutes. Or, I'm sorry, two for a type of rotation. Okay. So then you've got two minutes. You've got no temperature. I've got hot, cold, two, is level two. The S, if it was a signal for chemical, it's got no chemical, and then speed is one, and drain is zero. There's drain at the end is zero. Now we're on step three, formula eight. So you got Type of rotation is two. Then you got it for two minutes. No temperature pick. You got hot water by itself. You got level two. You got a drain. And then we make it to four. So you got three flushes on the front end. Oh, is the drain standard? Yeah, they're all standard. All right. So you got three flushes on the front end. Then you've got number four. It's running for 10 minutes. See, it's minute, minute, second. So that's 10 minutes. So you're gonna have 10 minutes where it runs, and it, 
then you're going to have 160 degrees when it's FFF for Fahrenheit. Then you're going to have hot water 1, cold water 0, level is 1. Alright, there's a 3 for signal 3, so it should be the chlorine, I would think. Oh no, sorry, that's for steam. Steam's going to come after. Okay, and it has choices also with the steam stuff. Alright, so then you got chemical 1. So that's the alkaline soap. Then you've got with or without level. So it says at level okay. On chlorine bleach, you want water in it before you add. So you always want to add it after the water's in. All right, so you got 12 seconds. It's gonna turn on the pump. And then you got number two. So just like right under the three, under the one, you can put the two. You know what I mean? So you know you got another one coming. All right, ten seconds. Then they got that's it, and it's a zero. And then we come in for the chlorine bleach the next step. No, that's okay. I just wanted you guys to get it. So you're okay with your recording? Yeah, I'm recording. Good. So anyways, you get the step five, and this is the bleach step. So here we go with 10 minutes on the bleach, 160 degrees. Let's see how he does it. All right. You've got the hot water. The level's one. The steam is three. So let's see what three says. Okay, it means it no early, it runs after, and the timer stops. Okay, so that's the choices it's giving you as number three on the on the on the steam. Then you've got chemical three, which is the chlorine bleach, and then you've got that one right there. When to inject at the level. So at least it's waiting until it fills up before it passes the chlorine bleach to come on, which is good. All right, so then you got 15 seconds, chlorine bleach. Okay, now we got one rinse, two minutes. Yeah, I missed all No, no, that's okay. Let's, She's concerned as well It's not good. So, okay, so here's your any immediate extract, and I want to say that's number nine. Which was the one we wanted to change? It's seven? Seven. Okay, let me go back over to seven. Okay, fine. All right, I'm gonna go back to seven. Here's my intermediate. I'm gonna make it a two, okay? So as a type of rotation, I don't mind it being a minute, all right? But I'm gonna make it hot and cold. Hot, cold, level's gonna be two and then nothing else. Drains, fine. Then I got that two minute one. He's got a split in there. I'm going to nine. I'm changing it to a two. I got the one minute. I'm going to split. Cold, hot and cold. Yeah, and a level two. All right. So then I'm down to 10. Here comes my sour and soft. I can live with that. I'm going to the next step is the extract. I can live with that. I go all the way through it so it puts it in. I go to yes. I hit the button. It says wait. It sucked the data. So now we took those intermediates out and we put in rinses. So I'm hoping that's going to help it out. The other thing that you can turn to, if you turn the key, you get this first choice. And then you get the second one. And then you get configure. Remember I was telling you about the water levels. It's got six of them in here. But you, they're supposed to be set with inches to tell you how much the inches are. So if you go to configure, English, yeah. Control, yeah. These are telling the machine what it has. But what we're looking for is the water level. There, inches in water for number one. Okay, you see that? It's low. Yeah. Okay, offset weight. Water level in inches, there it is, 10. Okay, so good. So I got 10 for one, two is 10. 
All right. Three is 11. Four is 12. Five is 13. Six is 14. Okay, so those are probably factory settings. So if I wanted to make it where I could see it, I'll put in a, a formula to check the water level. All right, so we know what those are. I'm gonna go like this, no extra water. This is just going through the thing, telling it what it is. That's the machine number for the board if it ever goes out. It's just a bunch of stuff, then it goes back. Now I can turn it back to here. This is what the biggie that I've noticed over the years in the industry. You, you get a washer, you come in, they everything's fine, you leave, you come back, they yell at you and they say, something's not right, it's not rinsing out, it's not doing good. So what I do is I put in a formula 30, which is gonna be a water level check. So what I wanna do is I'm gonna go, the first bath rotation, it's gonna be, I want the soak one where the thing's not gonna turn. Wash soak, that's the one I want. I'm gonna do it for, um, let's go for 20, that'll be 30 seconds. I don't know, want any hot water because it'll steam the glass. Cold water is what I'll take. A level one is right there, okay. And then I'm not gonna drain it. And I think it's two is not a drain. We'll wait and see what it says. Do not drain. All right, then we got step two. I'm gonna do a number three again. I'm gonna do it for 30 seconds. I'm gonna do it with cold water. I'm gonna do a level two. No drain. Three. I think it was three. Let me see. Wash soak. Go for one, two. Go for cold water. Go for level three. No drain. Four. I think it's a three. Is that soap bath? Okay. And I'm going for 30 more seconds. Oh, I put in 15. Okay, cold. It's four, so I'm going to four. No drain. Going to type of rotations, three. Go into two, go into cold water, five, is that step five, so it's easy for me to remember. All right, here we go. I think it's two is do not drain. And then the last one is six, so I'll go to the three, go to 15 seconds, cold water, Level six. All right. Yes. And please wait. Turn key. All right. So now I got a Formula 30 that's in it. So if I go back on here and I go to Formula 30, I go to start. See how it doesn't turn? So the water's coming in, but it's gonna fill up for 30 seconds to that level one. So that should be 10 inches so that it tells me I can see it. Well, if you go into a laundry and they're running stuff, you can't check the water level. So it's good to put in a formula like this and tell them to get it empty, then I can see the water level. Then I know water level one, two, three, four, five. Other machines only have like one and two, or one, two, and three. This one's crazy. I don't know why that it has so many. And then if you have a flashlight, you can put the flashlight in there and you can see where it's at. So it looks like it's like there. And it's gonna do it for 30 seconds and it's going to step two. And it's supposed to go an inch up. It also tells you if the water levels are working. So, number eight was the most formula that he runs all the time. So all we did was take out the intermediate.